warning, I will not be in the comments asking you to hit me up on WhatsApp to ask you for any type of cryptocurrency or money. Lately, there has been scammers going underneath old videos and old comments posing as me and trying to get people to contact them on WhatsApp. So if you see this, go ahead and dislike the comment. Go ahead and if you can, report the comment. I've been trying to do something about it, but it's just been getting worse and worse as of lately. So keep an eye out for that and let's get on with the video. So today we're gonna talk about five tokens that I've been currently buying into since the market started dropping and even today. And even today I bought some of one of these tokens. So these are five tokens I've really been interested in and I think have a strong future ahead of them. We all know the crypto market is way more volatile and way more unstable than the stock market is. But with big risk comes big reward, right? I do believe these companies will last and we will see them. Once we get out of this bear market, we can see a lot more happening with these companies than other ones. I mean, other ones as well, but these are the ones that I find I have a strong conviction in. I do own other cryptocurrencies. This is just the five that I've been buying heavily into as of lately. Real quick, this video is brought to you by Webull. If you guys do not have the platform, there's a link in the description below. Go ahead, download Webull. Using that link, make your first deposit of any amount of cash and you will get some free stocks, guys. Go ahead and do that. It's free money. You can take the money out. You can sell the stocks and buy crypto with it. So why not do that while you have the chance? And let's get into the video. So we're hopping on the CoinGecko app for a change instead of the computer. Um, so real quickly, I just want to show you guys the global market cap for all cryptocurrencies is up 3.6% over the past 24 hours. So we are $1.2 trillion market cap, which is amazing. But let's go ahead and get into it, guys. The very first cryptocurrency we're going to talk about is the cryptocurrency with the most dominance in the market. That's right. 38% dominance as of right now, we're talking about Bitcoin. And of course, who wouldn't buy Bitcoin, right? Bitcoin is the, again, has the biggest dominance in the whole crypto market. It is down 45% over the last year. It's all time highs was around 67 to $70,000 guys. And we are less than half of that. So of course we are reducing our risk tolerance by half, right? It says right here, all time high 69,000. So we're at 24, thousand dollars i've been buying weekly into bitcoin for the past i don't know two years now right and it's at the point to where i'm buying it at such a cheap cheap price compared to obviously all-time highs and when a lot of other people bought in other people bought in at seventy thousand dollars and said when it cut in half oh this is a scam i'm getting out of it you never want to do that right you want to buy the fear and sell the high sell the happy right so but actually with Bitcoin, we've been buying it dollar cost averaging into it. So yeah, of course I'm gonna have Bitcoin as my one of my picks for this, right? Next, you guessed it, is gonna be Ethereum, guys. Ethereum at 19% dominance, almost 20% dominance. So of course, why wouldn't I own a lot of Ethereum? These are my two major cryptocurrencies that I own. Again, looking at all time highs, we were floating at around 46,000. If we scroll down a little bit, we can see 48,000, close to $5,000. And Ethereum has grown so big and so massive, its network that so many things are built on the Ethereum blockchain, it's hard to take away from it, right? The only problem is it's gas fees and how much it actually takes to run apps and buy things on the Ethereum blockchain. But I'm still buying into it. And this is one of the bigger positions in my portfolio as far as crypto portfolio. Again, I have three main large positions in this list that you will see. Of course, I'll be buying Ethereum, especially with the merge coming up in September. Ethereum will be moving from proof of work to proof of stake, meaning you will not be able to mine Ethereum as easily anymore or basically at all. You will have to stake your Ethereum to earn more Ethereum. OK, next we scroll down. It's not going to be any of these. It will be number 14 polygon matic guys and right now it's at one dollar i actually bought some more of this this morning early hours of the morning before the sun actually came up uh to add to my position okay and again the highs of this was two dollars and 92 cents if you don't know what polygon matic is 
it's somewhat of an alternative when it comes to buying things on games on the blockchain it's very very cheap compared to ethereum you guys know if you buy let's say a hundred dollars worth of something on the ethereum blockchain for a game you'll be probably be paying thirty dollars gas fees so you'll be paying 130 bucks same thing here if you would buy a hundred dollars on the polygon matic chain you would be paying maybe a hundred and one dollars a hundred two hundred five at the most depending on what's going on so it is much much cheaper and not only that they also have an incredible opportunity with the partnership they got with the disney accelerator program if you guys don't know what this is i made a video about it and exactly what they have going into it but basically all it is it is disney helps certain companies accelerate and see exactly what they can do over the course of a year or so they give them funding and they give them a place to actually do it all right so they give them all of the material they need all of the space they need all of the funding they need to grow as a company polygon is the only blockchain technology that was chosen for the 2022 accelerator program and i think they were the only one at all ever that has ever been accepted for the disney accelerator program it's a business and development program so those are the three that i have been buying into lately especially since the course of the decline of crypto now we have one of my favorite uh cryptocurrencies we have Ethereum Classic, guys. This is probably my biggest position. Actually, it is my biggest position out of all cryptos that I own, okay? I started buying this at around, I wanna say $9, $10 in this range here. And from there, it's just going up and up and up. Guys, it's all time highs $167. If you don't know much about Ethereum Classic, it is the original code, the original blockchain it hard forked, it stayed the original chain, and then Ethereum grew from it. So Ethereum is actually its son, and it is a proof of work, okay? Meaning, once Ethereum moves from proof of work to proof of stake, Ethereum Classic will be one of the more relevant choices for miners to mine Ethereum Classic, guys. And not only that, it has been having a lot of backing lately, Recently, Antpool supports Ethereum Classic ecosystem with a $10 million investment. And we all know Antpool is one of the largest mining companies when it comes to Ethereum and Bitcoin. Also, Vit Vitalik Buterin, the, one of the creators of Ethereum, shouted out Ethereum Classic as the new proof of work mining system, okay? So I have a ton of Ethereum Classic videos. If you wanna check them out, go ahead, Go on my channel, type up Ethereum Classic. It'll explain a lot of stuff for you as well as a lot of technical analysis on Ethereum Classic. And finally, guys, we have one of the more, I would say, sketchy, but not really sketchy, but the sketchiest on the list. We have Crow or Kronos, okay? It's all-time high, was almost a dollar, and right now it's floating at around 15 cents, okay? And with that being as it is, we got, <clears throat> and with the price being where it's at, I do believe we can see a major increase in price once crypto starts gaining more traction. We know these crypto platforms earn more money and get more popular when crypto is on the rise, okay? Being that it's down right now, a lot of these companies aren't really making a lot of money. This is the native token for crypto.com. You guys, crypto.com bought a stadium. They have a lot of things going on and they're one of the biggest competitors of Coinbase. We've seen a lot of companies this year go down due to bad investments, go down due to fraud and a bunch of other things as far as crypto platforms. We have Celsius, Voyager, and several other ones. Unfortunately, I did have a ton of the native token VGX, but so that's unfortunate. But I am throwing some faith into crypto.com, hoping that they are not going to do the same thing as these other companies and make terrible investments but will stay true as a crypto platform. And hopefully this token will continue to rise. And I believe that it will. With crypto.com being such a strong name, they not only have crypto, they have NFTs, they have the bank cord, they have several other projects and opportunities lined up that I do believe they will be a major player in the future. And why not own some of the native tokens of one of the biggest players out there as far as crypto platforms. So those are the five tokens that I have been personally buying into more and more than the other tokens and coins that I own, okay? 
Let me know in the comments below if you agree with my picks and what have you been buying since the downturn of the crypto market. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter if you haven't. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram if you haven't, guys. I'm doing a rebranding of all my social medias and my YouTube channel. I'm going to have an announcement coming up over the next week or so about all that on my community page. So look out for that. Smash that thumbs up button if you enjoyed the video. Go ahead and hit that little red subscribe button to join the family if you haven't done so. And if you're still watching this video, go ahead and hit one of these videos on the screen if you want to continue your journey to financial enlightenment with me. I'm going to get out of here, guys. Peace, love, and prosperity.